We're at the HON-DAH Reservation RV Park near Sholo, Arizona. It's about eight miles out of Sholo, approximately. And they've got 500 sites. I'm told they're $500 a month. And I think that includes electricity. So let's go show you this thing. And you can get gasoline a little cheaper here. I'm gonna get gas on the way out. It's 3.30 a gallon for regular unleaded. So that's a dump station. So they must have some sites that are just uh, water and electric. But um, as far as me, I got a rattle here. Hang with me, guys. Always something with a video, isn't it? I mean, my stand now is broke because I tried to repair it. Uh, let's go in here. Okay, th these are the sites. These are just on dirt, gravel sites. Uh, these people have been here a while. He's got a cover for his RV. So apparently people just stay here for extended periods of time. And uh, I, I'm sure it's a hell of a deal. You know, they're right here in the piney woods. And these sites, uh, I, I'm, uh, I guess these are people that live here year round, maybe. I don't know. Elevation here is about 7,000 feet. And, uh, you know, they got 500 sites here. 500. And they're building 300 more. Yeah, this is a cash cow for them. Yeah, this is a Tuesday, or excuse me, Wednesday morning, August the 7th, 2024 at 10.03 a.m. Arizona time. Yeah, it's in the piney woods here, plenty of shade. Uh, you'd have a hard time using Starlink, but they probably have some kind of cable in here. But again, it's, a, it's the Apache Reservation near Sholo, Arizona. H-O-N-D-A-H Casino. It looks like you'd just call it Honda. Honda. Yeah, they have all kind of stuff at the casino. You, you know, you get, uh, it's a regular casino. You can go gambling. Yeah, this looks pretty good, but I don't see any, any vacancies. None at all. And it is definitely huge. Now, why that guy was going to a dump station, let's get over here in the shade and get out of the sun right quick. They're all the same back in there, too. Uh, I thought maybe there might be a newer section, but they're not. You know, these people have been here a while, man. All these people have been here a while. So maybe what they do, I, my, my guess is they're just paying year round and coming here in the summer because the winters here would be pretty tough, I think. So now you've seen the HON-DAH RV park. Yeah, they're all the same. I mean, it's, uh, but yeah, these are long-term RVers in here, man. I'll turn to the right here since it's in the shade. This is called Winners, W-I-N-N-E-R-S, Winners Circle. You'd be a winner if you got a spot. I mean, isn't that pretty? It's pretty. Uh, I'm gonna ask these people if they live there. They'll give me some info. Let me ask them. Excuse me, do y'all live here or stay here? Uh, no, not full time. Is it 500 a month, isn't it? Yeah. And that inc includes electric? That does. It does? No, no, that does not. It includes the water but in the dump, but not the electric. No electric. Yeah, I think electric is, uh, what were you saying, $100 for... Well, yeah, it's very, it's very on the year. In the, in the for 100 time, for the for winter and well, 200 okay. a month extra for the summer. Okay. Yeah, well, it looks like these people have been here for years. Well, this oh, place God. is huge. And it's yeah. Easy. We took right. a walk. It's like and way back there. Yeah, if you go back a ways, the spots get very big. Do they? Yeah, and, and it's like it's like renting a, 
lot. Well, well, what, what they, I guess they just rent it year round because yeah. some of them have oh, a lot of them. Yeah, like yeah. carports and stuff. Yeah, yeah, they definitely. Yeah, they got. Got little fences also. Yeah, that's all. I thought, well, hell, these you people. Go to the back area there? I, I, I went back there away. It's not not back way back in there. Yeah, um, if you go um, if you go back this way and then uh, all the way that you can, and then follow, there's a road that dips down. There's a little bridge that goes yeah. across. It. That, that goes into even bigger. Apartment. No kidding. Yeah. But they're, they're expanding it. You no, know, that's what I was told. They're, yeah. they're, they're adding 300 more spots. <laughs> they got 500 now. Yeah. yeah. God almighty, yeah. you know, yeah. that's amazing. This is rusty. Oh, <laughs> keep talking because I follow you. <laughs> oh, do you? Uh, yeah. yeah. Well, hallelujah. Uh, Hi, Hi. how are you doing? Y'all watch my channel? Yeah. Well, hell, that's, uh, there is somebody out there. Yeah, well, yeah, <laughs> There's one. Yeah. There's one. Yeah, well, no, I'm just checking this thing out here yeah. because I thought, well, next year I'd come here. Did you have any problem getting a spot? No. You no, didn't? They, no. You, you know, we're in little ones. They, they, Obviously, they keep the big ones for the monthly. But oh, okay, okay, okay. The, uh, but but, yeah, it was, we're just something in the corner. Well, where are y'all from originally? I live in Williams. Williams, yeah. Arizona? Arizona. I'm RV Pandemonium on uh, YouTube. RV Pandemonium? Yeah. Check out RV Pandemonium on YouTube. Yeah, I'm, I've got it on going right now. All right. Uh, yeah. But yeah, it's huge. Just take a drive around and stuff. And, um, well, they're, do, are, they're very helpful to haunt it. Um, they were giving a lot of a huge laundromat. They actually have two laundromats. Here. Do they? Yeah. Are they expensive? Are they what three? No, no it was dollar. a. I went to look. It's a dollar for a freaking um, Wash? washing machine. I'm like, what? I mean, where I, I am now? We're in another world. Well, you're going to eat, I guess. Yeah, right? yeah they have breakfast. In what? What is it? Expensive? No, no, no it's, it's a regular $1. menu if you order the menu. Five bucks, ten bucks for breakfast, or? Probably ten. I guess it's ten. Ten. Well, I might later, but no, I'm just cruising. Yeah, they, they have a a buffet uh -huh. in the evening. Oh, they do. But it's a very the limited buffet. buffet. Yeah. A what? It's not very long. It's not very. Oh, it's a items. short. Okay, I got yeah, you. Yeah, they they typically have. I mean, like on Friday, I I know they have uh, all you can eat uh, crab legs. Yeah. And the Friday, Saturday, on the weekend, it's all also all you can eat prime rib. I mean, that's good selection. It's good. Uh, yeah. Uh, well, do y'all gamble? I'm sorry. Do you I gamble? Don't. No. I don't either. No. I don't we either. Friends that uh, we were just answering that they gamble. Uh, and everybody wins. I hear you. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, RV Pandemonium. Check our channel out. Anyway, y'all have a good day. Yeah, you too. Adios. Bye-bye. Bye. What luck. Yeah, it's like winning the lottery there. So they put these smaller spots are for your short-termers, overnight, weeklies, etc. And then the bigger sites way in the back supposedly you got to go across a bridge uh well we'll go down here a little bit yeah we'll just do this deal i wanted to do this because i may come here next year and spend a month but i'm looking at it now you know is, is this me uh you know, it kind of reminds me of chalet camper village in a way because there's a lot of people here man you know and you're not far apart you know it, it, all that glitters isn't gold because you know if you're if it's a cool day or an evening and you've got your windows open and you're going to sleep you're going to hear voices you know what i mean you're going to hear people talking to each other and dogs barking and stuff because you can't put 500 uh people 500 rvers and that, that's a thousand people if there's say two people per rv uh that's uh a thousand people right here right close together i mean in a really small town but the good thing is it's uh you know the washing and drying is cheap and the food's not expensive and they got all kind of stuff so and it's convenient to show low for shopping and so there's some definite amenities some uh, pluses you know and if you found a i'm going to try to i'm going to find see if i can find the ones that they're talking about in the back they said they were huge might work you never know I'm, there's a dumpster well we'll follow it i'll get lost is what i'll end up doing i mean because i don't have a map in my mind of this place this is winter circles so i guess all the winners live out here somewhere 
these sites are a little larger now, uh, for sure. Uh, yeah, they're slightly bigger here, but they're still, you know, if people are sitting out, you know, having a party at night, you're gonna, you, you better enjoy it. How you doing there? Yeah, you see these older people like me riding these electric bicycles. I gotta tell you, that's good, but a three-wheeler would be much better. Why? Well, your chances of coming off or falling off a three-wheeler are slim. But on a two-wheel bicycle, you hit a rock wrong or a dog runs out in front of you and you lay that thing down, uh, it's gonna take you a while to heal. So this is the deal she's talking about here. There's a little bridge there. But anyway, two wheels okay, three wheels better. That's my own personal opinion. Why? Because I've had both. Yeah, you can pull up, stop and talk to somebody on a three-wheeler and you're good with a two-wheeler. You got to put the kickstand down or something. So these are here. Are they bigger? Uh, well, uh, yeah, I guess some of them are. Seem to be. But still, you know, even even if you were uh, 100, or 100 feet apart, uh, which they're not, you're still going to hear but bo human voices carry forever, you know, at night. When it's dead calm, no wind, and you got your windows open because you don't need to run the AC or fan or anything. Uh, yeah, this is, uh, yeah, you, you're going to hear something. I, yeah, I, am I going to find my way out of here? I, about a, a one in a hundred chance. <laughs> I'm going to turn here. I'll, I've seen enough shit. seen enough uh, I, I, this is the largest there there you go that's the one you want to be next to right there uh, but uh, the, the, I've, I've never been in an RV park this large ever in all my in all my travels never would I want to be here no no overnight maybe yeah we could do that but uh, yeah, there, there's a guy there raking his yard, you know. But that that's you know, different strokes for different folks. You know, the way I live is the way I live, and the way they live is the way they live. You know, there's no good or bad or who's right or wrong. It's just the way it is. You know, you do you, I do me. Should we ever disagree? I do me. There's a big old raven there. You know, those damn things are damn near big as turkeys and the biggest thieves on the planet. Now this is where I get screwed up because I think I came in down this way. I didn't. Shit. Glad I got gasoline. I mean, I'm glad I have a, I got a 191 mile range. Hopefully that'll get me out of here. I need to go to that gas station. Well, this has been an eventful day for me because I did want to see this, but I did not know it was that close to Sholo. I really didn't. So, guys, we're going back across this little bridge now. This little low water crossing. I know where I am now. So, have y'all seen enough RVs to last for a while? go to the right to get out of the sun, the phone out of the sun anyway. I mean, they have got them everywhere, man. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, from Honda RV Park, on the Apache Reservation near Sholo, Arizona on a Wednesday morning. We're gonna end this dog right about now. But anyway, guys, enjoy your life, keep your health, stand guard, door your mind, all that stuff.
I mean, I, I promise you, if I got drunk, had a few beers, I wouldn't be able to find my way home. Anyway, enjoy. Uh, use the Amazon link, drink plenty of water and all that stuff. Yeah, it's crazy, man. I mean, these people are living here. This ain't no joke. You know, they got their little carport. Well, I mean, this I'm sure it's a summer thing. You know, they come here probably in May or June and, and stay the entire summer from Phoenix and other places in Arizona. But anyway, guys, enjoy your life. Keep your health. Accentuate the positive. Eliminate the negative. And on and on you go. Adios, amigos. Bye-bye.